House of Hughes and welcome to our first vacation vlog. We are here in St. George. You guys saw us come yesterday. Blakely is already saying hi. Can you say hello, sissy? Hi. Blakely is eating some chicken nuggets and then we are going to change these cuties. Yeah. And then we are going to go out to the pool, which is going to be so much fun. Mr. Beckham, how are you doing, baby? Are you excited to go to the pool? Say yes, mama, I am so excited. So Hunter and I have brought the kids to St. George before, but it was last year. Blakely was only a few months old and Beckham had a really fun time, but we didn't really get any footage. Were we vlogging at the time? Oh, I think we just barely started vlogging. So I think we have a couple vlogs of that, like from way back when, but this is just gonna be like a totally different experience because the kids are so much older now and it's really gonna be like their first time really swimming with mom and dad. I know that Hunter is probably more excited than the kids even are so I cannot wait to see this little guy we have a cute little raft and life jackets and we are just going to go out and play and have so much fun in the Sun today I just went grocery shopping Hunter and I hit the gym this morning and grandpa helped us babysit which was so sweet of him we loaded up on groceries and snacks and we are just going to vlog the entire weekend for you guys oh my goodness hello mr. Beckham should we go get your swimsuit on <laughs> hi Hi, baby. Do you want to go swimming? Oh, what? Oh my goodness, my little talker. Do you need to have lunch before we go swimming? Oh my goodness, dad of the year. Hunter's looking spicy as heck, like normal. I never, ever, ever wear these shirts unless I'm going to He's so embarrassed to be wearing a tank top. Here, let's take a look at that arm. Oh yeah, from the burn. Do you guys remember that? Quick little update, it's healing well. Any of you loyal followers obviously watched my vlog. Oh yes, wait, that vlog yeah. literally went it's live today. today. But anyways, it's healing really well. I'm actually, I keep peeling this off. Oof. Does it hurt? No, it doesn't hurt anymore, but it hurt for about a week really badly. Oh awesome, let's go. Sissy, no throw. Sissy, are you all done? Eat. Eat? Okay, well you can't eat if it's not on your tray, girly. No, sissy. Say all done. Oh, hold on. Bubba wants attention. Hi, dude. I'm sorry, but this onesie is literally the cutest thing I've ever seen. I'm obsessed with it. When he was sleeping last night, you guys, I literally just stared at him. It was so cute. Oh, now sissy's saying all done. Good job, baby girl. All done? We can say that right before we throw the food on the floor next time, and that's going to really help just with overall happiness levels for the day. <laughs> She totally understood that, babe. 100%. Yeah, you know exactly what I'm saying, huh? You're so talkative. We brought all of their favorite toys and they've been doing so well, especially for being in a foreign environment. We will be giving you guys an update on how these little ones did last night sleeping, so stay tuned. I'm as fascinated with Blakely's water bottle and I am cracking up watching Dad try to figure out how to put on a swimsuit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There are some complexities involved. <laughs> Daddy said we made a discovery. Okay, you guys, can I see your swimmies? Beckham has on this cute little striped one. Sissy, can I see your swimming suit? Oh, you're so cute and shy. Look, it has little baby sharks. It has sharks, one of your favorite words. 
Do you want to go to the pool? Should we go swimming? Like baby sharks? Beckham is fascinated with that water bottle. Yay! Blakely, can you give Beckham a hug? Oh, you're so sweet. Okay, I have to give you guys a really quick update on how the kids did last night. So we brought a pack and play for Blakely, but she's kind of in that phase where pack and plays and cribs are kind of getting too small for her, like I've chatted with you about. So we put her down in the pack and play and she like passed out because she was so flipping tired because she didn't sleep on the drive up at all. And then she woke up about an hour later and was just like so ready to go back to sleep, but she was kind of struggling with the pack and play. So we ended up putting her in bed and I went and laid down with her and Hunter told me that I was not gonna be able to get her to sleep, but Grandpa Harv, there in the background, he had faith in me. You had faith in me that I was gonna be able to put her to sleep, right Harv? Yes. You did, he did. I have absolute faith in A hundred percent. Oh, and Blakely is obsessed with her grandpa, so this is what you'll be seeing the entire time that we're here. <laughs> But I went and laid down with her and she literally rolled over, started sucking her fingers just like she did when she was a baby and she fell asleep right next to me. So the night is going so smooth. Hunter Harv and I were watching a movie and then we went to bed and at 2 a.m. the freaking smoke detector. You guys, what is up with us and our luck with the smoke detector? No, really though. No, like Honestly. we have, Hunter, are you overwhelmed with your hotness right now? No. Sorry, you guys. We are married. Oh. This man is taken. You're so cute. You're so cute. Um, yeah. <laughs> what? What? My goodness. So, but at 2 a.m., the smoke detector starts freaking blaring because the battery's dead. So Blakely wakes up and she's like popping at this point because she's just had like a good little nap. I go in and get Hunter like a good wife would. Hunter is the sweetest husband in the world, so he hops up, he's like, I'll move Blakely to the other room, and he let me go to sleep with Beckham, so I got to sleep the rest of the night. We both only lost like an hour, because then Hunter was able to get Blakely to go back to sleep within like 30 minutes, which was amazing. It was fantastic. Yeah. And then she woke me up at 6.30, Rachel got up at 8.30, so we both slept <laughs> the same amount, is that what you're saying? He's the best husband you guys. Kidding. He's so sweet, sorry. But then I went to I the like gym, this. and then um, Rachel went to the gym, and yeah. so. It actually worked out really well yeah. for our schedule so that Harvey yeah. didn't have to watch them both alone. My oh. dad. I have to show you guys. They know who Papa Harv is. Yeah. I have to show you guys. Sis is obsessed with this chair. What are you doing, girl? She, she loves that chair. She is so funny. She's been in it all day. Okay, I also went to Starbucks to get us coffee. Oh, no. And I had to get a little coffee free frappuccino for Blakely with oat milk. And she kind of liked it. It looked so good, but it she only took like a few sips. It really does. Yeah, but she ate her chicken, which you guys know that she loves. She walked around and she was like, chick, chick, chick. So both the kids are ready to rock, huh? Say hi. Hello, handsome. He's all sunscreened up, and so is this little cutie. So we're just letting it set in for a second before we get in the pool. Hi. You guys excited? <laughs> She's copying mom, because I just sprayed her with sunscreen. <laughs> Good job, we have these little rafts. Oh, Blakely cool. hates them, so we'll kind of see how it goes. Mr. Beckham is gonna love the raft, huh? You're gonna love it. He does so good in the water. It really just relaxes his legs, which is so nice. Also, you guys, I splashed a little water on the bottom of this toy, like all of you suggested, and it's sticking perfectly, so thank you so much. <laughs> You ready to go swim? You ready to go swim? You wanna swim? Yeah. <laughs> She's so excited. <laughs> Here. Taking that out. Taking that out. Alright, mommy. <laughs> mommy needs to go get a new battery real quick.
so Beckham's kind of having a hard time. He had a few tears, so we're just relaxing over here in the shade, and ah. I'm just letting him play with his toy, ah. and we are just gonna hang out for a second. Ah. Taking a quick snack break. Mommy is having some questions, and Sissy is gonna have some fruit snacks. Oh, and she just dropped her meringue. Take a break. Click. Take a baby. Yummy. Blakely is so obsessed with fruit snacks, I can't even tell you. And the weather is like perfect. It's actually a few degrees cooler than it usually is, which means it's like, what, like 90? It's so hot still, but it's just perfect for the kids. Yummy! Good job! It's stuck under on purpose. Beckham's with Papa right now. Good job! Yeah, Grandpa has Beckham while he naps. Yummy! So, nice. so this is kind of the strategy for anyone that's a new parent or about to be a new parent or that doesn't know. If you bring, Sis. if you're blessed enough to bring your grandparents, you just kind of don't tell them that they're going to be full-time babysitters. <laughs> We're kidding. <laughs> She's like, get me back in the pool. Okay guys, we just finished up at the pool, so we're gonna go see if we can get Sissy to take a little nap. Beckham has been an angel and literally fell asleep in the stroller, so he just got to chill by the pool, which was so cute. And then Grandpa was with him for a few minutes while he napped. Our family should be getting here in the next couple hours, and we're gonna have games and eat good food, but Blakely is so obsessed with the water. I'm hoping that Beckham does just a little bit better tomorrow, but we will just have to see. I think he was just a little bit tired today, but it was definitely a win for Sissy. Hunter went in there to just like be with her while I changed into something dry and it literally took me less than five minutes and when I went back that's what I found. It's so cute and Beckham is out like a light. <laughs> Okay, Wait, hold on. these boys Wait, wait, have a friendly contest. Stop. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop. 
Hunter and Harvey have a friendly little competition going on. They're doing push-ups. So since I was a kid, since I was like 10, 8 or 10, he's so um, to me. I've looked up to me. <laughs> um, we've been doing push-ups. Like, so today we're just, we're just doing sets of push-ups. And so we'll do three or 4,000 this afternoon, three or 4,000 at night. Yeah, guys, there's so many. And then we come up short a little bit, that's okay too. We're going to stay hard. Family channel, our family channel. <laughs> no. It's a God. It's a David Goggins sandwich. Who is that? He said you can say stay hard, and it means like be tough. And you're so cute, right? I'm weak. Hard. Never again. I guess I should try to do that. Okay. Ready? Yeah, we are ready. Not really. Oh my goodness, look at that form. Yeah, Harvey's okay. form is amazing. You guys, he was in the Navy. So, the hunter, you need to look at your dad's form for a second. <laughs> he said. What, what do you mean? Oh my gosh, okay, so as exciting as this is, should we go look at Blakely while she's sleeping? Yeah, one <laughs> Good job, boys. How many was that? I think you did like eight. <laughs> Okay, so Beckham's still asleep and we don't really know like how that's a thing. So we're stressed, <laughs> but like not really because it's also really relaxing that the kids are down and everybody else is like an hour out. So I know I told you yesterday that I keep you updated with what we do for dinner and I will try to do that today if I remember because you know me, I'm a foodie so it's hard to remember to document my food before I eat it. <laughs> Okay, look who just woke up. Can you say hi, Mama? <laughs> yes, hello. I'm gonna feed him. We're gonna feed him in the stroller just because it's a little bit easier. Here, I'm actually gonna let him kind of come out of the little straps. There you go, Baba. Let me sit up just a little bit taller for Mama. Good boy. He is obsessed with the flavor sweet potato turkey in the restaurant down here. Oh, I forgot a bib. Shoot, I might have to go buy one more. Okay, well, pray for us. But he loves to play the sweet potato turkey and they have a ton at the store, which is so, so nice. So hopefully he does pretty good. Is there any bite? Sometimes he does have a really, actually I would say a lot of the time, it's a little bit more difficult eating in foreign places and not in his high chair and stuff. Um, yeah, yeah, sorry mom. Bye. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> So, no, baby. we'll make an attempt. Oh, oh, sorry. As we were saying. I really need him to eat something solid because I don't want him to not have... Coral feed. Well, you would just... Your mouth would be dry. You know what I mean? Your mouth would be so dry. It's so hot. I know he's getting hydrated and has enough calories for his belly. But I would love for him to just have something by now. Maybe we do the bumbo? I don't first, we'll do the G2 feed first and then kind good of idea. see. Because that's our priority, huh, baby? Bubba, show us your toy. Show us your toy, Bubba's. <laughs> He's been obsessed. Haven't you, babe? Oh, no, Bubba's. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, Bubba's. <laughs> oh, no, Bubba's. <laughs> Belly laugh. Oh, so cute. <laughs> oh no, Bubba. <laughs> so I brought three different onesies for Beckham. Yeah, did I bring so many onesies for you? And then I only brought one onesie for Blakely, which she obviously already destroyed. And thank goodness that, oh, well, yes. Oh, oh do I not need to fix it? 
She'll just do that over and over again so that you'll fix it. <laughs> Thank goodness we have Nani and Auntie Kate here. And you guys, Kate is going to be getting TikToks and shorts and all sorts of fun yes. content. So go subscribe to her channel if you haven't already. But so many of you did when you saw her nanny vlogs and they were so freaking cute. So I will leave it in my description box below and it will also be a pinned comment. But the boys just went to get dinner and we're just getting the kids ready for bed. So say good night to the little kiddos. We'll start a new vlog tomorrow, but we'll see how Blakely does in Beckham's onesie because she's already trying to take it off and asking Nani to put it back on. Yeah, are you gonna do a little bit better in the water tomorrow? What do you think? Catch your breath, catch your breath. <laughs> literally a three hour nap so I think he was just so tired and ready to go to sleep when we went to the pool so I have high hopes tomorrow that it will be so much more fun for him and we're also not gonna put him in the little raft we're just going to hold him the whole time so that, that way he feels comfortable and close to us but we will definitely keep you guys posted so I hope that you enjoyed today's vlog if you haven't yet be sure to hit that red subscribe button down below and of course we want to remind you to be brave like Beckham and we will catch you in the next vlog bye